Hello and welcome everyone to Silver Asset of the Day for the 24th of February 2022 presented by myself Phil Carr at the Gold and Silver Club. So this week we've seen silver prices, they've broken out 7% to the upside. Over this month they're now up 14%, breaking out to $25.50 per ounce. Now in the last week, hedge funds and money managers have increased their overall net long position on silver by 5%. Of course, we also saw a 7% increase in net long positions with gold in the last week, which we highlighted with you on Tuesday's gold asset of the day. We've now seen gold prices, they're broken out to 1,970 US dollars per ounce. As you know, we continue to hold positions below 1,800 US dollars per ounce. We've seen oil prices break out to 100 US dollars per barrel this week. So right now we have gold prices break out to one year highs. We have silver prices break out to six month highs. The commodity super cycle is in full throttle at the moment. We have inflation running at four decade highs. We're seeing this further boosted to the upside for commodities by the current geopolitical conflict with Ukraine and Russia. This is further accelerating capital inflows into commodities. In fact, Citigroup estimate that over 700 billion of inflows is moving into commodities the most in seven years. And with that, we're seeing over 27 commodities now hit multi-month and multi-year highs off the back of current inflation, which is at 40-year highs. And with that, we have Goldman Sachs, Morgan Stanley, JP Morgan rushing to continue to build out their massive trading teams to capitalize on the current commodity super cycle, which is forecast by Goldman Sachs to be a decade-long inflation trade that you want to make sure you are on the right side of here. Now, over the last two weeks here at the Gold and Silver Club, we've now banked with our clients over 15,000 points of profit, benefiting from this slingshot move higher on commodities as we continue to transition through the commodity super cycle. So of course, for that calculation, for every one lot contract that you'll be trading, that's $150,000 of profit. For every 10 lot contract that you'll be trading, that's $1.5 million of profit. We've been talking you through massive opportunities to be had here in the commodity markets. And this is versus, for example, cryptocurrencies, where Bitcoin over the last three months has corrected 50% to the downside, whereas you have oil prices and they're now trading at eight year highs, trading above $100 per barrel. You've got gold trading at one year highs at the moment. You have platinum, silver, palladium, all trading at six month highs and capital is moving into the traditional safe havens, whereas cryptocurrencies right now, they are being crushed. And this is where you want to take advantage of the current commodity super cycle we're in at the moment, where commodities have very clearly been utilized as the hedge against rising inflation. And we're also seeing gold and silver getting supercharged here to the upside as a result of safe haven demand. Goldman Sachs have put it best that the ultimate trade over the next decade is the inflation trade. So I do hope that you are also benefiting massively from the commodity super cycle that we're in right now. Now, as we get towards the end of the week, we have further data coming out. That is going to be GDP data, but the most important data point will be Friday's PCE inflation data. That is the Fed's preferred measure of inflation. And that is expected again to come in at over 40 year highs. So if we do see that, that could further supercharge the rally to the upside on commodities, you definitely don't want to miss out. If you have found that you're just getting chopped up in the markets at the moment, or that you don't have any exposure to these massive moves that we're getting in the commodity markets, it's very likely that you're either lacking experience or you're trading technical analysis, which as you know, does not work. If you're just trading technical analysis, you just get chopped up all the time, you're bound to get crushed in these markets. You want to be utilizing much more data and market intelligence in order to get your edge. This is where you want to use a research driven approach where you are utilizing statistics, data, market intelligence. You have awareness and understanding of the daily, the weekly, the monthly, the quarterly cycles for each commodity. Alongside that, learn and understand the capital flows, the intermarket correlations, the ratios in the market, key areas of liquidity. Alongside that, learning the fundamentals, the macroeconomics, geopolitics, and of course, how the hedge funds, money managers, banks, and institutions are positioned in the markets in real time, that will help you massively to get an edge. So with that, if you would like to join our community of successful traders, learn the research driven approach to the market and join our professional mentorship program, there is an opportunity for you to do so. Just make sure you click in the link 
below today's report in order to make an application to join our professional mentorship program.